Hey guys, it's Ethan to talk here, and we are back in our Minecraft building world. Uh, we are just standing on top of a mushroom in our mushroom biome right now. And as you can see, we're using a we're using a texture pack, and that texture pack would be Jollycraft 1.4. Five or seven? I'm not actually sure what version it is, but for what I'm using, all you need is only 1.5. So right here, you can see we have a deep cut. Um, I did have a recording, but I didn't like it, so I scrapped that. So I'm just going to show you guys how to recreate this sheep hut over by our house. So let's get on over there. So as you can see, we have a village really, really close to where you spawn, which is actually right about... Oh, God, look at this. So it's around over here somewhere. There's like a little pit of water and you spawn in that. So that's pretty cool. There's a village right close to it. So all you're really going to need for this is fence posts, leaves, or whatever other thing you want to use for your roof, fence gates, and glowstone or torches, some wheat, a chest, and some sheep. So what we're going to start doing is putting down the fence posts. You can make this as big as you want, but I'm going to make it 6x5 five or 5x6 five or whatever it is. 2, 3, 4, 5, So some of the stuff that's been going on with me lately, um, I have a lot of tests coming up, so I won't be posting much videos in the next couple of weeks. I also have a huge sign project which for 10% of the year. So I should probably continue on doing that, which I'll probably go after this video is all edited and stuff. And as you can see what I'm doing right now is putting down just some fence posts on the side, making it pretty high. And we're just gonna do that on all four sides. Oh my god, I'm just a slow builder guys. I'm sorry about this if it's painting you or whatever. Um, I'm thinking about doing I don't know, a survival series, but I don't know what I can use to record both computer sound and my sound since I don't have a microphone. So it's a little bit difficult and everything sounds kind of weird. So that's why the sound quality is kind of jumpy and bad in this video. So right now what we're doing is taking out our leaves and we are just going to put them all around this, uh, these fence posts. I'm going to leave out these corners here, if you can see, um, because it looks better without it. So we're just going to start going around this. Okay, here we go. So I'd like to know some of the stuff you guys would like me to build. Um, I don't have many video views yet, so it would be pretty helpful if you guys or anyone who's watching this could just give me a like favorite even if you don't do any of that just comment on your profile or something about me or just make a like so you can show it to your subscribers i'd really really appreciate it and it's possible that i could give you a shout out or a free drawing or do a, any requests to do active build if that's at all possible um i'm thinking about doing a couple one out one hour challenges i think it'd be pretty fun um, it would be by myself, because I don't really have anyone else to do it with, even though I do have a couple friends who play Minecraft, I don't know how to record sound on the computer, and sound that's actually going on at the same time. Even though that's kind of annoying, um, no one's actually told me how to fix that yet. I'm asking a couple of the YouTubers that I talked to a little bit, who do play Minecraft, and I'm hoping that they can help me out. But normally some YouTubers don't say what they record because they think that their recording software sucks. Um, so all that we have here, is this fence off center? This fence is off center. Well, we'll just put two down because she's super fat and they don't like to walk. Okay, so right now we just have this little cut. So when you go inside, you can take out your glowstone or your torches or whatever and just kind of place it down. And then after that, you can put down a chest, and you can get out your wheat. Even though I have one, I'm just gonna get out a 64 stack. And I'm also gonna get some shears, because I run out of shears really, really quickly. 
because in my survival world, I love using meats for stuff, and that can be kind of annoying sometimes uh, when I want to because I hate using a fire because I'm afraid to go caving. Yeah, I'm pretty much a wimp when it comes to playing Minecraft, I'll just tell you guys that much. So here you have all your pretty wheat. You can scatter it around a little bit so it looks more natural. So then just put your shears in the bottom. And then you can get your sheep. And if you're creative, spawn them in, bring them in with wheat, whatever. But I'm just gonna spawn them in there. Oh, they sound so cute, even though I know you guys probably can't hear it. So right now I'm just gonna get out some wheat. And oh, no attention. Oh yeah, I got your attention now, don't I? Oh yeah. Baby sheepy, baby sheepy, baby sheepy, where are you, baby sheepy? Here's the baby sheep. Isn't he cute? Yeah. So it looks the best in this texture pack I find. In default, it looks kind of weird, but uh, I will show you guys that. I also have Good Morning Craft. It looks pretty good in that. Oh, whoa, I forgot her. But um, it looks best in Jolly Craft out of all the texture packs that I use. Uh, one second. Sorry about that guys, that was my dad coming me down trying to talk to me. Um, so here it is in default. I think that it looks okay, but I am finding that it looks the best in Jolly Craft or Good Morning Craft out of all the text packs that I use. So we will just stand here by our sheep hut and I bid you farewell. Bye guys, till next time!